Hey guys, it's Chishka Buck here. Um, today I'm gonna be making a slad from D and D, and I'm gonna be painting him. I think I'm gonna make this one a red slad. So it seems like the slad, a red slad, is a dark red. So I'm gonna get out my Citadel paint with my Mephiston red, and I'm gonna base him with this. So I have a medium brush, this size. And I'm going to start basing it with this red. And here we go. Alright. Now that we have our slad all red. It already looks like a red slad. Uh, I think I'm going to paint all the horns black. Uh, so I'm going to do this with a small detail brush in Abaddon Black. There you go. Alright, this is the red slide with all the horns and spikes of that stuff painted black. Now, I think I'm going to do a tiny bit of black on the eyes here and here. Alright, I added a tiny bit of black onto the eyes. And it kind of pops a tiny bit. There you go, it's focused. And you kind of see the eyes. It's working out well. So now we're almost done with our slad. Now to finish the slad, but not the base, we're going to uh, use the entire thing in a red shade. We're going to be using Karosberg Crimson. So I'm going to get this all over the mini, including the horns. So the black horns, we'll get a little bit of this. Let's wait for those to dry, and then we'll do the base next. So I'm going to use a medium brush for this, and if you don't have this shade, because they are also pretty expensive, uh, all you have to do is take some of the red paint, um, maybe a little bit of black to make it darker, add it in a tiny bit of water and some soap, mix that up, and you pretty much have a shade. So I'm going to use a medium brush and just start lathering the entire thing. Alright, I have now lathered the entire thing in some shade. You can see the details starting to pop now. And now all we have to do before it dries is just pat it a little bit to get all the excess off because it'll get really out of hand. That's all the stuff that I took off. Because it looks very shiny and yucky when you do that. And this, I think that's pretty good. So now all we have to do is the base and we find a good color for that. So for normally starting off a base, I will use Agron Badlands, uh, except this base is already textured because this just adds texture onto the base. So I'm just going to be painting it with this dark brown called Doom Bowl Brown. So with a medium brush again, I'm gonna start painting the base. Alright, the final step for our mini is just to put a shade onto the base. We'll be doing Agrax Earth Shade and just leather that on the base and do the same thing that you did to the model. Then here we just pat this down a little bit with some towel, paper towel. Get off any extra shine and stuff so the ground doesn't look shiny, it looks dirty. When you add too much shade, everything goes wrong. That's not fun. You can't remove it because it's already dried. So, once we have that done, just add a little bit of glue. I use Zappa Gap, it works pretty quick. Come to the base. Then put this on your black base. Hold it for a few seconds, flip it over, and your mini is done. So here's my red slad, done in under 30 minutes. Looking awesome. 
Hope you guys like this tutorial. Um, also, this paint scheme works for anything. Like, if you wanted a green slide, just use a dark green and a dark green shade on top of that. If you want a black slide, I would do a gray and then a dark, like null oil or something. And same with any color slide, blue, all that. And you can create your own. You can make a pink slide, you can make a rainbow slide. But, yep, that is my attempt at a red slide. Looks awesome. See you guys next time.